One of the really nice things about the next gen uh, Caterpillar excavators is the ability to customize the joystick buttons to what the operator's preferences are. So we're going to show you how to do some of that today. So to get into the menu to customize the joysticks, you put on the menu button here. We're going to go into settings. And because there's no camera image, it's going to give us a warning. That's not a problem. Just hit OK. And then we're going to go down here to operator settings. And then we're going to go into operator input configurations. So in here we have our left and right joysticks. If we click on the left joystick, for example, it shows what is assigned already to that joystick. So we have cycling of applications is on our left button. Our horn, which is the one that is not reprogrammable, is, is the lower left button on the left joystick. We have radio mute and two with no assignment as of right now. Right now we're going to show you how to assign a button to the right hand joystick. So we're going to click on the right hand joystick and right here you can see that the bottom right hand button has no assignment. So we're going to make that our benching uh, button for our grade application. So we're going to go in here, press no assignment. We're going to go to the grade function and then we're going to go up through the menu and find our benchmark setting. We're going to click that. Now that's our benchmark button. So when we want to use our 2D grade application, we just press that to bench it. And then we can go back and then we can go to the home screen. And that's how you configure the joysticks. Very easy. <laughs>